if we just off the belt, we're right on the far end of North Island. I got a double rig here, a dropper loop rig with the V52 Bucktails, half ounce model. It's gonna drop it straight down. And this is pretty simple fishing. All we're gonna do is drop this all the way down the bottom with a sculpt in, small rock fish. We just want to get a bunch of fish for these guys so they can enjoy and cook them up at home. So fishing like here, got a 20-pound test line, and just gonna go all the way down the bottom. If you have squid, you can use squid to tip the bucktails with. You just want to have some sort of bait on there so when the fish bite it, you know, that they'll taste it. And then uh, what we like about using those bucktails is that if your bait does come off, it'll move around in the current and the fish will start driving. So even though sometimes we do lose our bait down there, we'll still get bit. So there's a fish. I'm already bit. Here we go. Here's a nice fish. This one's not a sculpin. Let's see what we got here. Might be a little lean powder. It's not running though, but it feels heavy. Should get bit pretty quick. I got bit soon to hit the bottom. Fits like this, you can just simple wind up. You don't have to pump it or anything. It's nice and easy cranks. You can see the reel I'm using. It's a small Pan International 975. Just filled out with 20 pound test line. And the rod I'm using is one of my insure rods. I use this for everything for calico bass, smaller white sea bass, even small tuna I've caught fish on it. This rock fishing works fine. Shell water rock fishing. Got here. Here it is, color. Yeah, it's just a little link cut, it looks like. A little link. Short link. Bit that bucktail. Um, these fish have to be a lot bigger to be legal in California, but. A little baby one. Nowhere near close to being legal. Let this guy go.